Guidelines for large gatherings in North Dakota have helped ease some of the stress for brides in the Red River Valley. Wedding venues went from only allowing 10 people up to 250. Valley News Team's crime and safety reporter Bailey Hurley talked to the local bride who says luckily her second wedding celebration will be a little more normal than the first. Getting married in a pandemic isn't exactly what little girls dream of. But despite the odds, Kyla Halverson and her new husband Austin tied the knot two weekends ago at the Pines with just 12 people total in attendance. It definitely went as best as it could. But the newlywed celebration isn't quite over yet, as the pair have a second reception date planned next month, something they decided on back in March when COVID-19 closures first started. It's really sad, like there's going to be a lot of people that are missing it, just because it's so kind of last minute changes, like people have to work, it's on a Sunday on top of it, but I just, I, we couldn't push it off. Halverson says they saved some aspects of their big day, like their first dance and unity ceremony for next month's celebration. Have that full new day magic again, and that's kind of what we were aiming for. She says around 150 people will be there, but like many other local wedding venues we spoke to today, Halverson says she's not exactly sure how social distancing that many people will look. Luckily, they have the room to fit that much so they'll probably keep like households and couples together like keep them and then just like spacing everyone out she says they're urging guests not to attend next month's reception if they're immunocompromised or feeling sick and will ask guests to leave if social distancing measures aren't being followed i'm sure there's many people that don't agree with what we're doing but we're taking all precautions in fargo bailey hurley valley news live other local wedding venues that we spoke with today say that meals are allowed to be served as long as they are not buffets and say dancing is also still allowed as long as guests don't congregate in one area.